You've covered plenty of fires in your day. You know, firefighters are heroes. They run into burning buildings when other people are running out, and when they see civilians do it before they get there, they know how brave that is. The story was a neighbor pulled her out, got her out, but it, still, I had no idea who the neighbor was. It turns out that neighbor was Mark Collum, a commercial fisherman who heard his neighbor's cries for help early Sunday morning. I'm just glad I was here and did the right thing, that's all. But there is more to this story. This is the same Mark Collum that lost his wife and two small children in a tragic Ipswich fire 20 years ago. On Sunday morning, Captain Ron Mary and his crew knocked down the rally fire after Mark had carried his neighbor out of her burning home to safety. I don't you know, I'm, I don't know if a lot of people would do that. The ironies continue. Ron Mary was among the firefighters who battled the blaze that took Mark Collum's family on that cold January night 20 years ago. And today, he was back evaluating the damage from Sunday's fire, confirming if Mark Collum doesn't go into his neighbor's burning home yesterday before they're on scene, Deb Shanahan may not be alive today. And if she was still in there, that that, that would have been a mess. Just hopefully, Deb's all right, and everything worked out well today. So I'm kind of glad. State Fire Marshal's office is still investigating the cause of yesterday's fire, but good news to report, Mark Collum's neighbor has been released from a local hospital. Reporting live from Raleigh, I'm Ted Wayman, WCVB, News Center 5.